Hey guys, I uh, hope you're doing well. This is uh, this is Tweak. Um, let's see. I decided I'm gonna try out some Civ Five. Uh, I don't know if you guys will like this or not. Originally, I was gonna play Warcraft Two, but unfortunately, the video recording software that I use does not uh, pick it up for some reason. Uh, I'm not too sure why. I mean, I've had trouble with it when I was, like, trying to do it on a Twitch, so I assume that it's just the same problems where it's, like, this ancient game, so the software just doesn't like it, I don't think. But anyway, so what we're going to do here is uh, we're going to do, I'm thinking, I'm going to try to do two 30-minute episodes a week, and uh, we'll just kind of have some fun with it. Um... I like playing Japan a lot, which means that obviously I like domination victories. So, since it's a domination victory, we're going to do Pangea. And I'm just going to try and close this one out as quickly as possible. So, maybe make some mistakes and so forth. And then if you guys are interested, then, you know, obviously we can change it up. I mean, if uh, people want me to, like, change it quickly, I'd be happy to just, you know... We could throw this away and start a new one. If you guys want, I don't know. Again, always have the disclaimer of not sure anyone's even going to watch this. So, uh, let's do Emperor difficulty? Wait, it says very hard. I don't know if I can do very hard. I'm not very good at this game, hence why I like domination victories. So let's go to advanced setup here. Random civs, I'm okay with all that. 20 ci city-states? That seems like an awful lot of city-states. Uh, Pangea, King, Ancient Era, 4 billion years. That's a long time. And we'll leave the other victories as possible so that I can just try to murder them before they all kill me. Um, yeah, sounds good to me. No barbarians? That doesn't sound good. Let's see. Don't want to do complete kills because that just seems like a waste of time. They'll just be running around, won't they? I also have the music turned off because I've heard that, you know, you can get your video silenced for having the music going, so a little concerned about that, hence why I'm not playing it. Yeah, I think this is all good, actually. So let's just start it up. May you long walk among its flowering blossoms. You are the ruler of Japan, the land of the rising sun. The Japanese are an island people, proud and pious with a rich culture of arts and letters. Your civilization stretches back thousands of years, years of bloody warfare, expansion and isolation, great wealth and great poverty. In addition to their prowess on the field of battle, your people are also immensely industrious, and their technological innovation and mighty factories are the envy of lesser people everywhere. Legendary Daimo, will you grab the reins of destiny? Will you bring your family and people honor and glory? Will you once again pick up sword and shield and march to triumph? Can you build a civilization that will stand the test of time? Yeah, I wasn't sure if you guys had seen that before. I'm sure that you have, but I mean, I suppose you can just skip it. It's not too long, but anyway, the Japanese have Samurai and Zero, which, both of which I usually don't end up using. Um, I might use Samurai, I'm not sure, just because I'm going to try and go quick, but the main reason why I picked them is because they all fight at full strength, even when they're damaged, which is like a tremendous advantage. So let's take our Barbarian here and do some exploring. Now, does this tile count as a river? Because if it... I think that this is actually just a very good spot to start. So... Let's just start it. Now, the first few rounds are kind of boring. Um, typically, I just start with a monument. And we'll do research. Let's go right into... Well... What does this require? Masonry? How do we get to masonry again? 17 turns to masonry. Uh, and how long would it take us to get to archery? 11 turns. Mm -hmm. 
trap. Let's just get an archer out real quick, and then and that way we'll be able to take out any barbarians that decide to come our way. In the meantime, we'll look around for another city. Uh, like I said, the first turns are kind of boring, usually. Uh, not a lot goes on, because I'm just waiting for my monument here. Typically, you get a new citizen, and then that, you know, speeds things up. Your unit equips itself with advanced weapons, so now we got some spearmen. Okay. Main goal here is I'm looking for a city-state. Which means that I'll be able to conquer him, and I think I see a city state right there. So let's go directly for that. Antwerp. I will take that. Your mercantile state. But you're also right next to the ocean, so I think. Let's just trespass real quick. This looks like the ocean. So if that's the ocean, then taking this seat this city could be strategically valuable, but they don't have any strategic resources either. So that's not too good. Across the river, that's going to take our full turn, but I don't want to attack across a river because then I'll just get destroyed. Yeah, let's go ahead and move in on these guys. Just because it's calculated as a, a big victory. Okay. Uh, what should we make first? I like to do a scout. Because we can just buy. Wait. Yeah, we'll do a scout. A scout's fine. And we'll finish these guys. Okay. Next turn. So yeah, uh, uh, I mean, I don't want to say that our channel starved for content or anything, but I also don't want to make you guys wait a week before we have anything at all. So, uh, I figure this could be a good series. I mean, I'm a little bit up, a little bummed out about Warcraft 2 because that's the... That's kind of like my, my game from childhood that I always wanted to show off and so forth, and, uh... So if anyone has any idea how to make it work, uh, you should let me know, because I would I'm dying to know. Basically, whenever I record, Bandicam just doesn't recognize that it's a uh, doesn't recognize that it is a like a .exe or whatever. So you know the game mode recording doesn't. It doesn't pick up anything, and that's not, you know, the game recording mode is the best way to record, so, yeah, because, like, if I try it in just the full screen capture, it just doesn't work, it just plain doesn't work. Uh, let's do, I don't like doing honor, because... I don't know, like, the lasting benefits aren't that great compared to the other two. And I know that we're going for, like, domination victory, but I think that liberty is best just because of, like, the benefits that you get. Settlers by 50%, construction rate increased by 25%, and you get a free worker. Yeah, it's, it's just real good. So let's do that. And then we'll go for the free worker next, and then we won't even have to build a worker, probably. Because what, yeah, we get four a turn, that's pretty good. Uh, almost ready for my soldiers to move out again. Now what I really want is the upgrade that gives you speed. I think that that is, or not speed, that will turn these guys into archers. Because they can move anywhere and like their talents stack so they can shoot from range and they can traverse any territory so that's like a unit that I would keep for the rest of the game just because of how powerful that that mobility is 
uh, compared to other units. Got a lot of barbarians around. Let's smack them. Probably shouldn't have had these guys wait for so long because now we're like surrounded. Let's. Uh, did we? How much north got explored? So we should go this way, I think. Actually. Oh man. They're everywhere. Thankfully, I got a full cup of coffee here, so hopefully, I can keep you guys entertained through this. I was kind of hoping that wasn't gonna happen. Are those ruins? Those are definitely ruins, but because we're in a tile, we're sharing a tile here, we can't, uh, we can only move one. I don't know what to do. I think I'm going to risk it in that I am going to try and take on, oh crap, I'm going to try and take on this encampment, and then my archer should be out soon and he can deal with them. And hopefully the scouts don't get demolished in that time period. Any settings that you hate, just let me know and I'll try to fix it. Come on, weapons. Nope, they increased the population though, which is good. Let's hit the hell so we can get some experience. Now we need to make something. Let's do a settler. We'll do a fast second city. Move in on them again. Because it's in our best interest just to eliminate the camp as soon as possible. I think. And our research should probably be masonry, right? Yeah, so we can make a quarry. And then we'll do animal husbandry and so forth. So we can get all these things together. Cows just provide food, I believe, whereas these are luxuries. Everybody loves luxuries. Okay, more barbarians. Wow. Let's take the camp and then we'll try to fortify on top of it. 25 gold. And see, I don't feel so nervous about just leaving them down here with these guys because of Japan's, like, really powerful ability. So... That was our turn. Hopefully these guys move over that range. Are they that stupid? Oh no, am I going to eat my words here? Maybe. I might have to waste a level if he doesn't die. Don't die. Oh my gosh, that's crazy. Oh man, the scouts are perfectly fine. Never mind. Uh, let's see. Let's adopt a 25% construction rate with a free worker and you guys I really don't want to waste your thing though it's my problem <sighs> tough decisions right from the start um, hmm. can we even retreat though is the problem no, we're just going to have to heal and fortify and I am going to move him down to provide cover. Where are we with masonry? Nowhere in here. So let us increase food. And capture these ruins. Yeah, I'll take those. 20 culture, wow. Okay. Hopefully they press their advantage here and get destroyed. I'm afraid I might have just given you guys a giant gulp, but hopefully not. I, uh, I'm a coffee addict, so I can't just uh, stop drinking coffee. It's just not possible. Not, especially not if I'm going to sit here for 30 minutes and talk. i gotta got to be able to talk. Uh, actually, let's come out of our fort and attack up a mountain. Jeez, that wasn't a good idea. Why didn't I attack them? Oh my goodness. So you'll find that happening all throughout the playthrough. It's me just making mistake after mistake. Ooh, but these guys are in range, and I think these guys are okay. Yeah, let's just press our attack. 
So this is my favorite sieve. Or not sieve, but, well, yeah, my favorite civilization game. Uh, because I just think the combat is the best in this one. As far as, like, strategically battling and so forth. I just think it's way more fun than the other installments. Like, Civ 4 is okay, but I don't know. I don't like the whole unit stacking thing just because it doesn't, uh, I don't know. It just doesn't tickle my fancy, you know? It just feels like you're tossing a million guys in every day. Plus five heal. Let's do visibility range and just walk right away from these boys. And we'll have to take this ruin now. Natural wonder. Where is oh the fountain of youth? Okay. And there's a river here. Oh my gosh, that's perfect for our upcoming settler. Nope, we're gonna try and eliminate it with the archers. So we can get some experience. Who needs orders? Nobody. Nine turns on our settler. That's quite some time. Hopefully, this food. Pays off for us. Ooh, city state doing some work. I don't know what busiest people means, but apparently I'm not. Oh, production. 12 production already? How does that work? That's nutty. Should I keep him near Kyoto? Yes. <laughs> Oh, I'm a coward. Too scared to send them out into the into the world by themselves. Let's march over here and then we'll fortify in the forest so we can get some health back. Get them up on the hill there. I don't like this either one of these engagements. So let's fortify and wait for the situation to improve. That's what any good general would do. Would wait for the situation to improve. Like I think it just did. Still haven't run into any sieves. Did I make the map too big perhaps? Let's say that I did. Let's go ahead and siege now. It's considered grassland, even though there's rocks there. So this should be work in our favor. Any problems with the audio or anything like that, please let me know quickly so that I don't you know, embarrass myself for 13 episodes. Wow. Can't believe you guys survived. Finish them off. Okay, that's that. I will retreat him. Gosh, this is crazy. There was a bandit camp here. I think that's my problem, so I'm going to have to use him to fight those bandits over there. I wish some of the stuff would hurry up. Let's fortify. And you're unable to move, right? Oh no, you can move. Cross the river into enemy territory here. Masonry. <laughs> and we'll do the same thing. We'll heal up here. We'll try and snatch. Yeah, we'll build a quarry so we can snatch that marble. Get us happy. We'll get a nice base of uh, happiness here so we can get into a golden age as quickly as possible. 288. What can we buy with that much? Archer. Yeah, let's do it. We'll do an early war. Choose research, animal husbandry, into trapping. And then where is. Yeah, construction is what I want to do after that. So that we can take out a sieve or that city state over there quickly. Because I like that whole prospect of ocean tiles and so forth. I think that will help us tremendously. Okay, now they should be safe to make their way down to here. 
And I like the idea of founding the city here because there is a river tile. As well as this fountain of youth business, which I am perfectly alright with. And we are not going to send him unescorted. Let's eliminate them. Okay. And our production is going to be. Ooh, should we try to rush pyramids? 36 turns is a quite a few turns, and we have almost no production at this city. Whew, these decisions are always rough for me because I never know what I want to do. Like, obviously I want to conquer people, but I also like having a lot of culture. I really like culture benefits. So, these are always so tempting. Let's do, let's try for the Temple of Artemis. I know this is probably a huge mistake, but... Plus one happiness for each city you own connected to the capital. Plus one production in every city and 5% production in cities when constructing buildings. Does a wonder count as a building, though? I don't know. Let's try it. I probably shouldn't have next turned, but oh well. Oh, here we go. They're going to get attacked next turn if I'm not careful. So I think the play is actually... Hmm. They are about to level up, though. I still think the play is the move to a defensive position. We'll fortify till healed there. And we'll move the archers down two. And him down two. Just because I've had those taken so many times, I just cannot trust. Though I probably could as they make their pilgrimage across the desert, but I'm a wimp. What can I say? These guys, I hope they're fortified. I hope you boys are fortified. Let's keep moving. Are you fortified? I think you are. Why would you? They're just like on a death march here. Let's promote them and we'll give them sh an open terrain. That's, you know, that, this is me using maximum foresight here. Okay. I'm gonna like, upgrade them to help me in the exact situation that I'm in. Can they reach the spot already? Yeah, okay. So that's the river tile. I'm gonna build it right there just because it recommends it. Oh, hello. It's about time for you guys to come out of retirement, I think. Boy, this city-state's going through it. Boy, really glad I moved to that mountain terrain. Osaka. Found it. Surprise, surprise. I'm gonna build a monument. Any tips or anything, obviously I'm open to that, because like I said at the, right at the start, I'm not exactly the greatest at this game, I just like fighting battles. As you can probably tell already, I'm way more focused on that than any logical or intelligent decisions as far as uh, statesmanship goes, but hopefully that's okay. Why would I do that? The river runs this way. Oh, it's okay, they'll probably be eliminated by the time they get there anyway. I think it's about time for these scouts to move out. Oh. Uh, where are we here? Let's smash them again. Foolishly charge across the river. Next turn. We'll be in a defensive position there. trapping yet, uh, but we do have that. Let's go straight down to the cattle and build a pasture. I think that's the play. Tried to f work on the breathing thing. Hopefully that's not an issue at the moment, but we shall see. Gonna try to do two videos a week here. No guarantees though. Definitely one. 
Uh, and I know that spec is going to do something too. I should have said that earlier. Um, so keep your eyes peeled for that. I'm not sure what it was that he's planning on doing, but uh, if I had to guess, it's a sim of some kind. Like, I mean, it could be the sims. Who knows? I know he was kind of on the fence. So, but we're trying to do both, like combined stuff and not combined stuff. Yeah, because we're our own peoples. We have 16 happiness. That's insane this early on. Oh, look at that. More villains to conquer. Uh-oh. Just soaking up the experience right now. Who needs orders? Uh, let's heal. And we'll move you forward and let you attack because you don't have the advantage of... Uh... Oh, it's merciless out here. These barbarians stand no chance against archery currently. I don't know what the rules on barbarians are either, but we're losing our bonus now, but that's okay. We just want to soak up their experience. Let's go here and hope we don't get attacked. Ooh. Oh, I just met Quebec. Whoops. Okay, let's do that. And then we'll just send them on in to clean it up. No, these guys have got to just do a march double time over here. But that's okay. All next turn. Let's head this way, and we'll do... Oh, these guys haven't even been... Oh. Wait, no, these are the ones I wasted the upgrade on. I wonder why... I guess they just now got enough experience. Um, let's head this way and I'll send them down to fight these guys. I feel like that was a mistake on the barbarian's part. Oh, really? Still alive. Okay. We're gonna head this way. Yeah, queue up five turns worth of movement. Well, we almost have Temple of Arnos probably going to get demolished by spec for wasting 16 turns of my capital on a wonder, but I don't know, that seems really helpful as far as making the... Oh! That's not good. I don't think they'll come out to attack me, but they might. I've seen it before. Ouch. Hate to see it, ladies and gentlemen. What if we just cut them down to size right now? What are you gonna do? Attack me? And they did attack me. Probably should have moved before we attacked, but it's not the real thing yet, it's just barbarians. 조선의 oh. 궁궐에 당도한 것을 환영하오 낙선이여 나는 나의 훌륭한 백성들을 굽어 살피는 깨우친 임금 세종이여 들어보겠소 봉지여 우리는 상의해야 할 것이 많고 I'm going to make it three gold a turn that's not very much Oh man, these guys have got to get out of here did I turn on Raging Barbarians or something? Why are there so many of them? Oh, man. I'm gonna need more... We're gonna need more arrows. Oh, jeez. Oh, we can't retreat that way either, because we're trapped. Uh... I think the scout's doomed. Fortify? I don't know what to do. Because we have to eliminate that camp, too. I think it's dead. That's unfortunate, but there's nothing to be done. Sometimes you just gotta write off your boys. As for these boys, we're not gonna write them off. Though they are in a very tight spot. 
Okay, that's uh, my 30 minutes, so... Let me just uh, silence this. Okay, so let me know how you know you liked it, if you found it interesting at all. Probably not. I mean, the barbarian conflict has been pretty nutty so far. I don't know if I've ever run into this many barbarians at the start. I must have raging barbarians on or something and just didn't notice. So I guess I'll see in the cutting room floor here. But yeah, keep an eye out for uh, more videos of this series and uh, I believe Spec is going to start his own pretty soon so look out for those in the coming weeks uh, yeah we'll see you later for now